video highlighting the danger that pedestrians face when trying to cross the street. Look at this. This was taken on Glenway Avenue near Price Hill, Chile, showing two people stuck in that crosswalk right there because nobody will stop. WCPO 9 News reporter Jake Riley is breaking down that video. He explains the steps city and the police department are taking to keep folks safe. He's here with us in studio. Jake, what's going on? Well, Tanya, this is a look at a stretch of Glenway Avenue here in Price Hill. You can see these dots here. They represent pedestrian crashes, 10 in total over the past year, one of them causing serious injuries to a 19 year old woman. Now we're looking into what's being done to enforce safety. Clayton Adams, a lifelong Price Hill resident, knows crossing this stretch of Glenway Avenue can be a tough task. I think it's definitely not the most pedestrian friendly uh, place to be in, in the city. The dash cam video taken Thursday on his way home from work shows what he says is a scary reality for pedestrians. There are at least four schools within walking distance of, of that particular crosswalk on Glenway. And it's just kind of sad to me that young people um, you know, who walk have to deal with scary situations like that. The video shows two people trying to cross Glenway near Relium Avenue in a marked crosswalk. You know, because they were basically stranded in a crosswalk on a very busy street. Um, and then car after car, including a police officer, you know, refused to stop and, and let them cross the street. Cincinnati police releasing a statement Friday on the incident, saying in part, quote, the action of one officer doesn't define how District 3 or CPD operates. Pedestrian safety is and has always been a priority for the department, end quote, saying they'll focus on traffic enforcement for as long as it takes to get drivers to obey the speed limit and keep pedestrians safe. The city is stepping in, too. We really need to put our money where our mouth is, and uh, it's great to talk about solutions and uh, that are meaningful, but to really invest behind it is the real imperative. So Cincinnati Mayor Aftad Puraval two weeks ago proposed spending $1 million for speed cushions in 30 different neighborhoods of Cincinnati to slow down traffic. He says they'll be placed in areas backed by crash stats. Craig.